Hello guys, it's Rainbow Runner. Welcome back to another episode of Rail Fanning. Tonight we're recording this on the evening of uh, February 27th of 2024. And yeah, we're two days away from Leap Day 2024. Yeah, Leap Day like this. Woo! Yeah, I was standing on top of that power box. But um, yeah, I just thought I would... I'm back here at uh, Cooper and Guadalupe because um, I thought I would... um film the train a little bit from an elevated view. Um, we have an inbound on its way right now. Um, um, I know that Arizona Rail fan are just uh, texting me the locomotive number. Um, um, and actually, yeah, it's coming up right now, so I'm going to get back. Um, just wanted to give you a quick view down the tracks. I'm yeah, doing a little bit of a moonwalk right now. As I'm, huh. yeah. Oh, and actually, I'm, I'm gonna get into position. All right. Um. Okay. Yeah, the headlight is coming into view. Um. Yeah, two days away from leap day. Um. Yeah. Um. The day of the week that Leap Day falls on goes back by two um, every four years. Like 2016, it was on a Monday. 27, or no, 2020, it was on a uh, Saturday. And then here in 2024, it's going to be on a Thursday. Um, oh, yeah. And the train coming panels have now activated, as you can see. Um, and I believe that means uh, Guadalupe Road's going to get its uh, crossing gates um, activating first. Okay, I can see the top of the crossing gates here at Guadalupe activating. Um, again, I remember when I erroneously believed that um, it was the direction of the train that determined um, what gates activate first. But no, it's the, the like um, uh, Mark, aka Railroad Train Spotter, proved and it proved it was um, it's the whatever light, ha whatever street has the green light. Um, and uh, anytime you want to activate Cooper, thank you. There it is. Yeah, you better back up, man. Here it is. This train isn't even going that fast, but... Some of those tank cars have like the the tops that are either that are colors other than black. Like I saw a yellow, 
saw yellow tops, I saw blue tops. the coil carts, as I, I believe they're called, um, according to one of my uh, viewers. Those flatbeds with the uh, uh, steel beams. So. Movie Eve. <laughs> Railroad carts can have a lot of interesting graffiti on them. Not that I'm condoning such actions, but... <laughs> Okay, now we're, we're back to the black and tan car tops. So. And I think the end of the train is actually coming up and we have a, two locomotives at the end of the train. And you'll see what they are in just a second. Six, seven, oh one, five, four, oh one. All right, and the gates here at Cooper Road are rising. They have turned off, and up go get the gates at Guadalupe Road. Yeah, Cooper's rose, Cooper's gates raise first because they have the green light right now, as you can see. Um, yeah, I'm looking down the tracks, um, yeah, obviously the train is disappearing, um, you know what, I, even though I have let, kept filming until it rounded the corner around baseline, um, I don't think I'm going to do it this time, um, yeah, as you, but there is the red signal, um, actually look at, look at down this, um, um, if you look at, um, you see that flashing si signal at Elliot, but, um, I see, like, some other flashing lights and stuff, um, down the track, um, it's almost like one of the crossing gates is still active. Um, and also, if you look over that way, um, the the water tower here at, at, at um, in downtown Gilbert is actually um, off because they're actually doing construction around that area, including all the water features beneath it and all that stuff. Um, there was also that um, that water ball type thing that was that's kind of fun to play around with and spin um yeah they have actually they have one of those in tomorrowland at disneyland i'm um, right next to space mountain and they also put one in a california adventure themed after the uh the luxo junior ball at pixar pier um so yeah going off on the tangent um again right there um yeah you see that that flashing those red lights that are flashing not the one on the side but the the ones off there um I mean, I mean, my first guess would be a, a radio tower, but it kind of looks like um, there are some crossing gates that are still going. Okay, um, but yeah. All right. Well, I think it'll be it for this episode of Rail Fanning. Um, I definitely wanted to get one out before the end of April, or why did they say April? Um, February. Um, and. Yeah, aside from my uh, mini rail fanning episode um, where I filmed the light rail. But um, yeah, I've been busy with college, obviously, but I still want to make sure I can occasionally get videos out for you guys. I appreciate you guys for being patient, and this is your reward. All right, well, Rainbow Run is going to head home. I got a lot of things to do, and I'll be heading out for now. See you later.